So here at Mullen Dino, we run a double shift uh, in manufacturing coffins and caskets, and it starts from 6 o'clock in the morning until 11 o'clock in the evening. We produce nearly 40,000 coffins and caskets out of this facility here on the Gold Coast each year, and the total Australian market is about 140 odd thousand deaths per year. And obviously death rates change seasonally because in winter people uh, get flus and that's where the death rates go up, where we're just coming into our busiest period right now. And during summer it's very quiet. People don't realise how much actually work goes into a coffin. And the process is that the uh, solid timber and the MDF panels all go through one end of the factory. They get all prepped and processed and sawn to the right shapes, sizes, because there's so many variety of sizes in coffins. We have large ones, we have medium sizes, and then you've got your smaller ones as well, right down to your child's coffins. It's very confronting when you see the child's one. You sort of think, you know, that's a young person that hasn't had a life, where if you see an older person, you know that they've got many years of stories to tell and they've had their life, but for young people it's very confronting. It does make me stop and think about it uh, each time. Uh, I lost my own son back in 2003. Going back through that process when I first came here to say, wow, that's the casket came out of this factory that my son was in. So it is confronting. Once it's polished and comes out the other side, then you've got to look at the interior side of the, of the coffin. So the lining side is always done last, and that's where you know all the pillows and everything is put together. And then it goes through an inspection process to ensure that there is no defaults with the casket, make sure the paint is right and make sure the interior is right, that all the hinges and everything work. Once that's all gone through, it is then transported around the country. We try and do the best we can to, to be able to deliver a, a comforting process for the family. We're constantly coming up with ideas. How do we make it different? How do we make it more stylish or contemporary and, and bring it into the age of what we're living now instead of the dark ages?